had to laugh. You know, we laughed about it. Okay, you know, I got to tell you this story. We're going to start from the beginning. This is how small this freaking world is. You got to be a little older to remember this. How, how long has it been? 40, 50 years? I was 15 years old, so 54 years ago. Okay, 54 years ago, a plane was hijacked and to Cuba. They hijacked it to Cuba. And Beverly just told me that her best friend, Marilyn, that she grew up with, go ahead and tell the story now. You're going to have to speak loud, though. He was on a flight. He was headed to Florida, and the plane got hijacked and went to Cuba. And he was drunk. And when they got to the airport in Cuba, they were showing footage of the Cuban military in the airport, armed, and they had a man encircled, holding guns on him, and it was Marilyn's father. <laughs> because he was drunk and showing out, here, you know, rowdy. Uh, that is just incredible. And they didn't hurt him, and they let him come back. Yeah. They, they didn't want him. So what about the hijackers? Were they Cuban hijackers? Yeah. Or they were? Yes. Okay. Isn't that amazing? I barely remember that. What a small, small world. Was, so, uh, and we laughed at the time because it was so ridiculous. What What is that five degrees, six degrees of separation or something like that? Where something. everybody is related to, you know, five degrees away from some important event or a important person or, yeah. So your best friend growing up, her dad was on a plane that was hijacked to Cuba and he made the national news because he was drunk. In the, in the Cuban airport showing his ass. <laughs> God, that's hilarious.